hello you're welcome how to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here well, what we have here we take 5 raised to the power 6 to left hand side and we have x raised to the power 6 minus 5 raised to the power 6 equals to 0 here the next step we can write this as x raised to the power 3 or raised to the power 2 as 2 times 3 give us 6 minus also 5 raised to the power 3 or raised to the power 2 then equals to 0 here. And this follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into brackets, open brackets, a minus b. As this here, a standing as x raised to power 3, and b standing as 5 raised to power 3. As this here, what we have becomes x raised to power 3 plus 5 raised to power 3 into brackets also open brackets x raised to power 3 minus 5 raised to power 3 plus brackets equals to 0 here at this here we have two possible cases x raised to power 3 plus 5 raised to power 3 equals to 0 or we have x raised to power 3 minus 5 raised to power 3 equals to 0 here then solving on this side, this follows when we have a raised to power 3 plus b raised to power 3, which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket, then open bracket, a square minus a b plus b square. That is, here we have x plus 5 into bracket, open bracket, x square minus 5x plus 5 square plus brackets equals to 0 here which implies a writes as x plus 5 into brackets then open brackets x square minus 5x plus 5 square 5 times 5 that's 25 close brackets equals to 0 here also, we have two possible cases here. The first one, x plus 5 equals to 0. Or we have x squared minus 5x plus 25 equals to 0 here. Then, solving on this side, we have x equals to minus 5, which is a real solution here. And here we have a quadratic equation. We are here equals to 1, b equals to minus 5 and c equals to 25 applying the quadratic formula which is x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac all over 2a this here we have x equals to minus minus 5 plus or minus square root of minus 5 square minus 4 times 1 times 25 all over 2 times 1 that is here we have x equals to minus times minus that's plus we have 5 plus or minus square root of minus 5 squared that's 25 minus 4 times 1 times 25 we can write that as 4 times 25 all over 2 for this next step we have x equals to 5 plus or minus square root of 25 is common here we have 25 into brackets 1 minus 4 then over 2 that is here we have x equals to 5 plus or minus square root of 25 times 1 minus 4 as minus 3 all over 2 and this follows when we have root a times b. And separate this as root a times root b. That is this here we have x equals to 5 plus or minus root 25 times root minus 3 all over 2. And this here we have x equals to 5 plus or minus root 25 also 5. Root minus 3, same thing as root 3i and over 2. That is, here we have two complex solutions here. Then, 
Solving from the second case here, this follows what we have a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3 do the same thing as a minus b into brackets, open brackets, a square plus a b plus b square. But this here, all we have becomes x minus 5 into brackets, then open brackets, x square plus 5x plus 5 square close brackets equals to 0 here. Then here we have x minus 5 into brackets, then open brackets, x squared plus 5x plus 5 squared, that's 25, close brackets, equals to 0 here. Also, we have two possible cases. First one, x minus 5 equals to 0, or we have x squared plus 5x plus 25 equals to 0 here. And solving on this side, we have x equals to 5, which is also a re-solution here. And also here, we have a quadratic equation. We are here equals to 1, b equals to 5, and c equals to 25. Also applying the quadratic formula, that is, we have x now equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 5 square minus 4 times 1 times 25 over 2 times 1 which implies here we have x equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 5 square 5 times 5 that's 25 minus 4 times 1 times 25 that's same thing as 4 times 25 all over 2 that is we have x equals to minus 5 Plus or minus square root of 25 is common. We have 25 into bracket. 1 minus 4 left here. All over 2. That is, we have x equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 25 times 1 minus 4 minus 3 all over 2. That is, we can write this from where we have root a times b, which is the same thing as root a times root b. This here we have x equals to minus 5 plus or minus root 25 times root minus 3 all over 2. And this here we have x equals to minus 5 plus or minus root 25, also 5. And root minus 3, that's root 3 high all over 2. Also here we have two complex solutions and therefore all together in this problem we have six solutions here two real solutions here two complex solutions here and also two complex solutions here and thank you for watching don't forget this step subscribe for more videos and turn notification bell share this video with thumbs up and put your comments see you next class and bye for now